Hello, my fellow Bakugan Battle Brawlers. I'm here today with another video. Uh, this time, we'll be opening up the Bakugan Armor Alliance Bakugear pack um, containing the Aqua Patrick Ultra with his Bakugear, um, Darkest Rampirian Ultra. Then, hold on. Okay, apparently mine has a, a slight hiccup instead of coming with this Aquas Hydra's core. Uh, it seems like it comes with a Pyrus one, which is uh, interesting. I don't know if that is a mistake. If the wrong Bakugan is on in here or on here, so by the character cards, I'll know that. Uh, this does look like a Ventus Cycloid, which is alright. I don't have... I mean, I already have an Aquas Hydra's core. Um, Alright, so let, let me just go ahead. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Uh, I didn't notice that in the store. Obviously. Um, okay, well, anywho. Uh, yeah, so in here it comes with two Bekugan Ultra, one Bekugan Gear, two Bekugan, eight Bekugan Cores, four character cards, four ability cards, one instruction sheet, one Bekugan Toy by Link's rule sheet. Um... Yeah, okay. Uh, let me go ahead, because there's no other picture of the other Bakugan on here. Uh, let me go ahead, uh, take these out, and just do a little, um, briefly look on the interwebs just to see if this is a mispack or if this is the wrong faction here. Um, all right. I have them now out of their uh, packaging. Uh, I did a look. I did do some research. And this this is supposed to come with the Pyrus Hydra's core. Just whoever was doing the box wasn't paying attention. Or maybe they changed uh, something last minute. And put that Aquas picture up there for whatever the reason. Um, here, let's just go and take a look. Uh, before the back on at all the cores and cards it comes with. Get the instructions out for Hydrus and not Hydrus, uh, Batrix and Rampyrian. Uh, first things first, Baku Coors. What do you come with? You come with a uh, plus five damage uh, Fire Fist, Flaming Fist, Red Flaming Fist. Oh, okay, my camera just cut out for a for a second. But anywho, uh, yeah, so Flaming Fist, 500, not 500, 5, plus 5 damage. Um, shield for Aquas and Darkus, plus 400B power. Uh, Green Fist, 100B power. And then for Darkus and Aquas, an extra 3 damage. Uh, shield, 300B power, negative 1 on the energy, cost for Baku Gear. Uh, we have a Green Fist for plus 100 B power, and then for Pyrus and Darkus, plus 3 damage. Uh, 200 B power and negative 2 on the gear cost. Uh, plus 2 damage, Green Fist, with a negative 2 on the gear cost. Oh, last one. They're all still stuck together here. It is a Magic Shield uh, with 500 B power, negative 1 on the energy cost. Alright. Uh, not... Entirely the best lineup of cores. I mean, this one is, I think, like, the best one out of all this, depending how you use them for. Um, yeah, okay. So, cards here it comes with now. We have our Ventus Cycloid. Uh, Flaming Fist and Shield. Base 600B power, base 2 damage. Aquas Batrix Ultra. Uh, with Fist and Shield. Base 500B power, base 4 damage. And if, it, if you do put it on the Shield core... Uh, it does an extra 4 damage. Darkest Ramparian Ultra. Uh, Magic Shield and Shield. Base 800 B power, base 2 damage. One of the better uh, Darkest Bakugan to use, because you'll get your 1450 B power that way. Uh, okay, yeah, good. It does come with this card. Um, so whoever did the artwork for the back of the box, they uh, they weren't paying attention or something. Uh, so we have Pyrus Hydra's Core. Uh, double green fist, base 500B power, base 4 damage. 
Uh, then we have Dark Helm, 300 cost, plus 200 B power, plus 2 damage. Baku Thrusters, uh, 400 cost, plus 300 B power, plus 3 damage. Uh, Ventus Channeler, uh, for 10 energy cost, plus 1000 B power, plus 10 damage. Oh, wow. Pyro Hammer, uh, 6 energy cost, plus 100 B power, but then 12 damage. Oh my. Alright, so that's what uh, this thing comes with. Uh, let's go ahead, first things first, let's check out, let's just check out, uh, the main guy, uh, let's check, no, let's check him out last, save the best for last, first things first, we'll take a look at the Baku cores, our two new ones here, alright, doesn't really matter how you roll them out, although doing the arrow is recommended, uh, but as long as you try to line it up well, it shouldn't really matter. Uh, so we have our Ventus Cycloid here. Uh, spots for back here, him, are on his arms here, here, and then right up here on top of his head. Uh, B-Power symbol is over here, 600. Ventus. Yeah, there's Ventus Cycloid, nothing really too special about him. And then we have our Pyrus... Hydra's core. Oh. Maybe, I don't know, I think I was just too hard on that roll. Uh, but yeah. A new a red lion. Oh, I pretty much like this guy. Because uh, it is red lion. Um, back here's spots for him arms on his back legs. Here, here, and then right there in the middle. Uh, faction symbol here, and his B power is right there, 500. Yeah, just Pyrus Hydra's core. Alright, uh, next, let's go, let's just put these two, uh, to the back, for now. Let's take a look at Darkest Vampirian Ultra. Pretty nice, one of the stronger, darkest Bakugan. Uh, he doesn't come with any Baku gear in this, but spots for him are on, on his sides here, here, and then up here. It's looking pretty cool. Um, Alright, so for closing him, let's take out the instructions. See how to do it. Alright, so manual parts uh, being his feet, so we're going to go and fold those back in. Uh, then so we're going to come up, and the back ones, his spikes go down, his head comes back, and then his tail uh, wraps around him there. So... So the front feet are going to come back, like so, feet are going to come up, like that, spikes are going to go down, his head is going to fold in, and then the tail after that. And there you have your darkest Rampyrian Ultra closed. Alright, so let's go ahead, roll them out, we'll put Batrix off to the side. First we'll do it forwards, backwards, then side to side, uh, and then on his side, we'll want to roll him out three times, just to see how he rolls. Alright. Then we get more range of him when he jumps. Alright, three, two, one, and Bakugan Brawl. I may have seen things shift a bit, but I did. It took me a few tries to actually roll them out because I think I was just going too fast, and then he ended up gliding over the course. Um, but he kind of does open on his. He does open if you do roll them forwards. I just want to try that one more time just to see. Um, okay, that was a bit better, but uh, but yeah, okay. Uh, so going forward, yes, he does roll out well. Just maybe watch your speed. I'm not sure. If you do use Rimperian, always just, you know, practice out rolling with them and everything. All right, now let's do it backwards. How are we not supposed to be doing it? Well, that was a heck of a lot better, that's for sure. He opened up beautifully. I did roll him backwards, right? Roll him... This, yeah, rolled him up this way against the arrow. 
So that is interesting. If you want your Rampyrian to, you know, pop up like this, roll him backwards. Don't know why. I guess they put the arrow on backwards or something. I don't know. All right. Now let's uh, roll him on his side. Uh, I'm not sure how that will open up because it is interesting because he opens up like that. So maybe it's a, I don't know, 50-50. All right. Let's see it going on his side. Three, two, one. Roll. <laughs> All right, he did open up on his side, so that's cool. Uh, so Darkest Rampyrian Ultra. Uh, my suggestion, if you do want to use him, roll him out, do it backwards, because that will be the more graceful option, if anything. Uh, all right, now we're moving on to the main boy, Matt Batrix, here. Our translucent Aquas Bakugan. Looking uh, pretty nice. Um, so putting on his Baku gear, I want to take uh, these guys, stick them on the sides here, and get the other one right there. All right. All right. I'm going to take this. It's already opened up in the packaging, but to close it, just... We're just going to have to bring these clothes down, just like that. So you close it, and then just drop it on. And But it is kind of back heavy, so he will flop over if you do it like that. If you just drop it on him. Uh, the wings, there we go. I might, 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 might have changed it. Uh, let's do that again. Drop it. Yeah, he's really back heavy <laughs> with this thing as you can see, which is slightly unfortunate, but he has his tail as a kickstand or something there. But it always doesn't really work out the best. Uh, anywho's, enough of his Baku gear. Let's go on to roll him out just to see which way is better, forwards, backwards, or side, or on a side. All right. Uh, before we roll him out, we will close him. So let's look at the instructions for those who don't know. And it also refreshes my memory a little bit. Um, but yeah, his head, his manual... Does he have manual parts? No, I don't think so. Um, Alright. So his head on his ears, they're going to kind of... His head's going to go down, ears are going to come in. Uh, then his wings, his feet, and then his back piece. So, take Matrix, head go down, ears, then the wings come right in after, wanting to have his head here, the tail, and then the back piece, just like that. Okay, uh, let's go roll them out now see which way is best first let's do it forwards here as that is the more preferable option all right three two one bakugan brawl well, that was beautiful he opened up really nicely that way all right uh now let's do it backwards um Considering how well he opened up forwards, I don't think he will open up that well backwards, or he might just fly off or not even pick up the back of core. All right. I'll make sure everything is locked into to place here. Okay, let's try it backwards now. Yep. Did not even pick up the back of core. All right. Uh, now let's do it on his side. Just to see if that's any different, better, or worse. Okay. Yep, did it pick up the back of core. All right, so... Uh, for rolling out your Aquas Metric Ultra, uh, do indeed roll him backwards. Uh, 
uh, not backwards, forwards, how the arrow shows you, as that will get you your best and most grateful, grateful, graceful uh, result. Eh. Yeah. All right, that's essentially going to be it for the end of um, this here video. Uh, but before we do end it off entirely, um, first things first, let's go ahead and check uh, all the new background we got off of our list and everything. Blah. Stay there. Okay. And all the all the cards just so you know what exactly there is okay uh checklist checklist, checklist. okay so for core back we've gone here i've got a cycloid ventus cycloid first things first ventus cycloid got that and Pyrus Hydrus Core. All right, got those two. Uh, Ramparian Ultra Darkus, yes. Batrix Ultra Aquas with Baku Gear in Deedly. All right. Now those are all checked off. Uh, one last thing before I do end off the video entirely. Uh, we are going to go and open up a booster pack. This one is going to be from uh, Resurgence. Just because I've opened, I haven't opened up a Resurgence pack in a minute. Uh, I've been opening up a lot of Age of Orlis recently. And it is still one of the only three packs available here in Canada. The other two being, you know, Age of Orlis and Battle Brawlers. Uh, fortunately, no other sets yet are available. Uh, when or if we'll get them, who knows? But for now, we got this. So let's see. We got uh, Aquas Hyper Serpentis, Chaos Titan Mantanoid, Ruin, Aquas Hyper Tritonium, Dual Strike, Web Snare, Darkest Titan Mantanoid for our first rare, Pyrus Hyper Trox Ultra for our second rare. Ooh, okay. We have Darkest Titan Tertonium Ultra for a Bakugan Elite. Almost, almost similar to Rampyrian there. Uh, then for a Hex. For a Hex. Oh, I forgot about this. Okay. So Flash Flood is one of the special Hex cards that isn't entirely all Hex, but only a little bit of it. As you can see here in the artwork, if I angle uh, my... In the light, you can see all the windshield, all the glass, and the windshields, and the windows, and the cars. Uh, that's, that's basically all that there is, is Hex, is just the, the windows and the cars. Which is interesting. Really interesting. Um, don't know why they did it, but they did it that way. Alright, so we have an Aquas Hex card, and a Darkest Elite card. To go with the theme. Um, Alright, well if you enjoyed this here video, uh, please leave a like, comment, down below. Subscribe and turn that bell notification on so you know when my next video goes up. And until next time, my fellow Bakugan uh, Battle Brawler, so fun battling, brawling, collecting. Uh, just remember to stay safe, wash your hands, wear a mask, practice your rules. Till next time, sayonara.